Seven years since the shooting death of Ibrahim Todeshev, his family now finally getting their hands on the evidence from that day for the first time. He was killed in Orlando in 2013 during an interview with the FBI and other law enforcement officials. ABC Action News reporter Mary O'Connell was there as his family unpacked the evidence here in the Tampa Bay area. An emotional moment for Abdulbaki Todeshev. <laughs> Nine years in the making. Why kill they, they, my son? In 2013, his son, Ebrahim Todeshev, was killed in his Orlando home during an interrogation by the FBI about his relationship with a Boston bombing suspect. The only connection between him and uh, the Tarnov brothers was that they happened to have attended the same gym. Officials later indicated they would not bring charges against an FBI agent involved in the shooting. Now, for the first time in nine years, the Todeshev family got to see the evidence surrounding their son's death. Todeshev's father arrived from Russia this week to collect the items. My life after they killed my sons, uh, broken on two parts. Keys, a sword, broomstick, and table. And they claimed that it was a broom. Then they claimed that it was a sword. And blood-stained clothing all returned. Ultimately, all we've asked for throughout this process is answers, transparency, and accountability. And it's outrageous that the family has never been able to confront their children's killer in court. A sense of closure while family continues to call for reform. We reached out to the FBI regarding this case. They had no comment. Mary O'Connell, ABC Action News.